Joe Torrens, hello. How are you, sir? Nice to see you. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine, thank you. The boss is happy. Mr. Yeah, McClellan. I think so. I think so. With, uh, with the win, you're also always happy. Yeah, um, look, he said, he said, look, you're building up to Rio, uh, you build up to big games. That's a big game, a game you had to win, and you're taking on a great India side. So what was the approach? What was the mental approach? Yeah, like you said, it's uh, since the beginning of the tournament, we're making step by step and taking match after match uh, because we have uh, Rio in mind. And uh, it's been a while uh, that we haven't played together, so uh, we had to come together on the pitch and find the automatism again. And uh, like you said, it's, uh, we're growing. Yeah, you looked a little bit rusty uh, against Korea in the first game. That seems like a miles, a, a days and days ago. But you look a different side now. Yeah, we we analysing very well uh, how we do, and, and and we pretty know how how we want to play. So uh, the things are, are clear. We just put uh, have to put in practice. Yeah, guys, you're impressed with the uh, performance, not only of this man but of the team. Yeah, I think I was really impressed. I have a question though to ask. Towards the end, the India took off their goalkeeper. Is that something that you've spoken about? Playing with a with a basically like a man down when uh... yeah it's, it's certain we have a tactic against that so it's uh, always special and uh, it puts a bit of a, of a pressure on us because they one man more uh, but again it's part of the game and this is kind of situation you have to deal with and, and certainly we prepared for that well yeah they handled it well they did handle it let's see the story of the game uh, because uh, we wondered how you'd approach this against an India side that have been very very impressive and you took the lead here uh, with a short corner move which was not exactly sharp against Korea. No indeed we are struggling a bit with the corners for the moment but uh, we're happy that we can score one today. A um, bit difficult with the pitch but uh, it's something that we have to deal with and uh, and again okay we scored today we didn't score in the first two matches but again something that we're going on. And you say it's a bit difficult with the pitch we, ha we had the Australian goalkeeper Tyler Lovell was here with us earlier on he was also talking about the pitch so what's what's the problem that you find? Yeah it's Ah, it's not an easy one, and suddenly with the weather, it's uh, a bit uh, a bit slow. Uh, but I think maybe it could be the same in Rio. So uh, again, it's uh, good uh, conditions to train on. Yeah, um, uh, there's nothing slow about the equaliser uh, <laughs> from India. Uh, there was a bit of a collision. I don't know whether you've seen the strike. I don't think anyone saw the strike in actual uh, speed. But uh, what a finish! What a finish, Simon. Yeah, absolutely. I'm not convinced that Vince Vanash needed to play the ball because I think it was coming across maybe past the post, but the finish was absolutely electric. It's one of those things that a player I think just looks and goes, I've got to hit this as hard <laughs> as I possibly can. It nearly took Stroy Young's head off. Yeah, you'd have been pleased with that, Jerome? Yeah, it's the, the kind of goal that uh, India can score and uh, it's a guy alone in the circle. It's something that uh, doesn't need to happen. Uh, and again, in this action, we uh, lose a free man. So that's actually uh, a bad point for us on that action. Uh, but they finished it well and hopefully we could score a second one. In a, Do we in see your winner? We want to see your winner. Are you going to talk us through call? it? Come on, <laughs> the talk us through it. We love it. I, I love it just to see because uh, I like to see when players come off they're, they're hot and sweaty but they suddenly get composure <laughs> when they look at their own goal. Yeah, it's. Um, I, I must confess that I not always uh, score on, on, on the shot so that's why the guys uh, are a bit joking with me but uh, I'm happy the goal. I put the ball quite good in, in a good position and uh, happy to shoot and uh, maybe the goalkeeper could have done a better job but uh, likely it's, uh, it's in it. Oh no, don't say that. Tell your teammates you hit it so hard you knocked him over. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> as he fell backwards into the goal. Yeah, it's balanced. I'm not balance known for my power in the shot. So, uh, uh, you're the hero, you're here, but it was a real team performance, indeed, wasn't indeed, it? Yeah. I mean, some of the defensive work, guys, was absolutely incredible here. Yeah, so we looked at penalty corners. Yeah, okay, it was Raga who was going round the number one runner, but then saved on the line. Vince Van Asch gets a left foot out but doesn't quite get there, so it was picked really deep off the line. And Belgium had to defend very well. Super save from us on with the right hand there. Great pick, only just over the bar, but Raganuth hit flicks it so hard. Well, we said we we're looking forward to that battle, the battle between Raganath and, uh, and Van Asch and goal. And I think, yeah, I think yeah. Van Asch came up on top. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, up next, just a little matter of Australia. Yeah, it's going to be another big, uh, big game, but uh, all games are big over here. So, uh, again, we're going to try to make a step uh, further and uh, prepare for you. Okay, brilliant. Thank you very much for joining Thanks us. Many congratulations. Good luck against Australia.